Good afternoon, everyone. My name is Miriam Jackson. I am back again with another video. If you all did not get an opportunity to watch my first video that I put out on yesterday, please go in to watch that. It's on in my first introduction on godly principles. Today, our subject would be, what are the five benefits of being single? Number one, you get a chance to become financially responsible, meaning you get a chance to get all your finances together, your credit, your money, whatever else you need to get together before you uh, 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 meet the person that's coming your way. Number two, you have to figure out what you want out of life. What do you want to do? Do you want to travel? I mean, you got to figure that, figure that, you have an opportunity to get that figure out while you're still single. Number three, you have to get in touch with yourself. Get in, love on you. Love, just love on yourself. Let your, give yourself a big old hug. <laughs> you know, just love on yourself. Get in touch with your, your spiritual, your, your mental, your physical. You know, get in touch with those things. What, of what you want, what you what, what are the things that you want to get in touch with yourself? You know, get, get, you know, get connected with all those things. Um, four, number four, you have to learn how to enjoy your own company. We look for other people. We we look for other people to come along with us so we can enjoy them. But what about enjoying yourself? What about loving on you and doing the things that you would like to do? Okay, and number five, if you do these things, your confidence level will shoot up. Loving on yourself, getting in touch with who you are, spending time with God. I mean, figuring out what you want out of life, getting your finances together, credit. So your confidence level will go up because you have everything in order. But the most, the most important thing that will help your confidence level go up is knowing the word of God over these things, praying daily, studying the word, and not just being a do, not just being a, a reading the word, but also being a doer of the word. So, if you like any of this content information, please like and subscribe for more. Thank you all so much, and you all, you all have a wonderful day.